In this video I will be showing you how you can save selections to channels and how you can make them into paths. And first of all you will be needing your layers, channels and paths dialog here. And if you don't have it, then go to Windows, recently closed docs and with a bit of luck it says layers, channels and paths here. And you can click on it and otherwise you can uh, open your layer dialog by going to dockable dialogs layers here and say you you have just your layer dialog open then you can add a channel and a path dialog by clicking on this little icon here and then add tab and click channels and then again add tab and click paths and then you have your layers channels and paths dialog open okay now uh, I'm gonna go to my image window here and I have a selection open here and let's say I want to work outside the selection because I'm going to pretend this is a very complicated image that I'm working on but um, I need to deselect the selection to work uh, on the complicated image outside of the selection uh, but I want this selection back later so I'm going to save it for now so I can get it back later and then when uh, and then uh, to do this, I need to go to select, save to channel. And what you can see in your channel dialog is that it is now saved in as a channel. And you can rename it by double clicking on it. And I'm going to call this selection because it's my selection. And now I can go to select none. And... When I go back to my layers, it looks like nothing has happened. But when I go back to my channels and right click on selection here, and I can click on channel to selection, and my selection will be back. And with this selection, I want to make a path. I want to make a path out of this selection. And for that, I'm going to, uh, first of all, back to my layers dialog, because um, you always need to go back to your layers dialog, because otherwise, things in GIMP might not work. So now I'm going to, to make I'm going to make this selection into a path by going to select and click to path. And you can see nothing happening here. And when I click select none, it looks like nothing is going on. But when you check your paths dialog, you can see that okay this is my previous selection. I'm gonna pretend it wasn't there. That there is a selection here. And you can rename it selection, I'm going to call it selection, the same way as you can rename a layer or a channel, just double click on it, type in your name and press enter. And to make this path visible, you click here and a little eye, just like the layers uh, dialog, the eyes will appear and then you can see your path. And if you want to make it invisible again, then just click on the eye again and now when we go back to the layers you see nothing but there is a channel and I want this back so I think I already did this excuse me if I knew this twice uh, I do channel to selection and there's my channel back and there's also a path in this place so th this is how um, you save uh, selections to a channel so you can activate them later again when you have deactivated your selection and how you can make them into paths and I hope this was clear uh, if you have any questions just comment on this video and if you like the video please subscribe and watch my other videos thank you for watching